Good morning, computer science students. As you can see on the board here, from today we are going to start a new topic that is related with the same chapter. The new topic, name of the topic is binary file operations. Right here, you can see the topic binary file operation. We have covered text file operations in the previous video lectures, and now it is the very first video of binary file operation. Right here in this video. So I am telling you about some basic concept, about some basic feature that you should install in your mind always if you want to create a binary file operation related program. Clear? Here, our today's topic, it is divided into five different things. Just see, here, board is divided into two different parts. This part contains the content of the video lecture and here we will discuss on some sample programs that are related with these concepts. Right here, very first, what is a binary file? A binary file is a file that stores the data, that is store your program data into binary format and this particular file is not understandable directly by the user if he is going to open the file in the notepad. Right here, in this file, encrypted data is there. Data is encrypted into binary format and you cannot understand what is there inside the file. Right? So here, just see, if you want to shift your program data into a binary file, very first thing we have to measure how many different type of data is available in our Python. We are having a string. If you want to store a string, text file is there, you can store the string into the text file, right? Yes, you can store the string variable, string data in the binary file also, here, right? Now, just after the string, list is there, tuple is there, dictionary is there in our Python, so these three things are called objects of Python, list, tuple, dictionary, these are the objects, right? If you want to store data of these objects into a file, you just take binary file operation commands, right? Here, list, tuple, dictionary, we are having some confidential data in that object. So if you want to store the data in the binary file, the data is encrypted, it is confidential, it remains con uh, confidential only. Here, to store the data in the binary file, very first thing, right, very first thing, you have to import pickle module of Python, right, our Python is having lot of different, different modules, math module is there, panda module is there, numpy module is there, Pickle module is there. Here, the role of this pickle module, it is directly related with our binary file program, binary file operations, right? So that if you want to store your program's data into the binary file, konsa data, se bata rao. If you want to store the data in the list, tuple, dictionary, one series concept is also there in our Python. If you want to store the series data, if you want to store the data frame, in the file, you just use binary file operation commands and here, for binary file operation, very first concept is you have to import pickle module into your Python program, then and then only you can use binary file operation commands, right? Kaise aap import kare? Just see here in the sample program, just see the line number one, import pickle, just Right, import, it should be in a small letter. Pickle module, it is also uh, in a small, a small letter format only. So here the first line of your program should be import pickle. Right? Now, the second concept is, one theory question is related with this particular uh, section. The concept is, what do you mean by pickling and unpickling? These two words, technical words are there related with this section here. Pickling means what? Pickling, mean, pickling means your software data, your program data, if you want to convert your, yeah, if you want to store your program data into a binary file, very first, your data should be converted into a binary format, into a stream of bytes. 
right so here it is known as pickling means to convert our program data into the stream of bytes so that the stream of byte easily is stored inside the file clear it is known as pickling now what is unpickling here if you see the binary file the data inside the binary file is in the encrypted format you want to read a binary file so for that you have to convert the binary data binary data means what a stream of byte you have to convert this stream of byte into your normal object format you have to convert it into list convert it into tuple convert it into dictionary so to read a file you have to convert the binary data into your object format it is known as unpickling and to write your object python object data into a file you have to convert the python object list tuple dictionary into the stream of byte it is called pickling process right now we are here with this third concept here once you import the pickle module in your program kya hota hai importing ka matlab kya hai pickle module is there in this pickle module different different functions are there related with a particular aspect right if you import the whole module to your program it means what suppose 10 different functions have written inside the pickle module and if you import the pickle module with your program you can use these 10 functions inside your program it is known as importing the thing clear so once you import the pickle module with your program all the functions all the library functions that are there in this pickle module you can use these functions with your program here two most important functions are there in this pickle module we just discussed here we have to discuss these two function we have to cover these two function kon kon se function hai the very first it is dump function and the very second it is load function both the functions are there in the pickle module right what is the role role of this dump function now dump function means if you want to write your program data into the binary file the function that is related with the writing process it is dump right kaise dekho just see the formation of this dump function here object to write the object which you want to write inside the file you have to write the object over here then comma then you have to write the file handle the file object by which you connect your file by which uh, your file is linked right just dump object to write comma function if you want to see in, uh, uh, what is the role of this dump function in this programming is let's just see the sample program number 1 import pickle right here i am using my file variable as a file handle right my file open project dot dat comma wb right it is also the file mode is also changed here now just see dictionary one one variable is there in this program dictionary one and this dictionary variable contains three different element one two three now if you want to write this dictionary data into the file just see the command pickle dot dump dictionary one what is dict one it is my object right dict one comma my file when you write this command and when your computer is going to execute the command the data that is there inside the dictionary is going to write in the file handle write in the file object right so here this is a dump dump function dump function is related with the write operation of the binary file one more function is there and this one is known as load function just see number 4 load means what if you want to read the data that is available in the binary file by using your python program you have to load the data from the file into your python program <coughs> for that <coughs> load function is there right kaise chal raha hai object equal to load file handle inside the load function you have to write the file handle file object name inside the dump function object comma file handle name this is the syntax of these two functions so 
very first thing want to write something in the file you use down want to read something from the file you you use low clear a text file mein kya hota tha <coughs> text file mein if you want to write something in the text file write command is there write line command is there right lines two different commands are there if you want to read something three different commands are there read read line read lines ठीक है अब वर्ड कमांड्स तो थी टेक्स फाइल ऑपरेशन से जुड़ी हुई नाउ इफ यू वांट टू यूज बाइनरी फाइल ऑपरेशन ओनली टू फंक्शंस आर देयर जस्ट यूज दीस फंक्शंस फॉर रीडिंग एंड राइटिंग दैट नाउ द फिफ्थ कांसेप्ट जस्ट सी व्हाट इज देयर इन द फिफ्थ पोजीशन हियर चेंज इन द फाइल मोड ओपन फंक्शन द फिफ्थ इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग राइट व्हेन यू आर गोइंग टू राइट समथिंग इन द फाइल यू जस्ट यूज अ स्पेसिफिक मोड राइट मोड जिसको अपन बोलते हैं इफ यू वॉन्ट टू रीड समथिंग रीड द डेटा फ्रॉम योर फ्रॉम योर पर्टिकुलर फाइल तो अपन उसको रीड ऑपरेशन बोलते हैं एंड आर स्मॉल आर वर्ड इट इज रिजर्व फॉर दिस रीड ऑपरेशन स्मॉल डब्ल्यू इट इज फॉर राइट ऑपरेशन स्मॉल ए इट इज फॉर अपेंड ऑपरेशन ऑन थ्री ऑपरेशन आर देर हियर इफ यू वॉन्ट टू रीड राइट और अपेंड a binary file for that just see what are the different file mode in text file operation for write something we use w only in binary file operation if you want if you want to write something in the binary file aapko w use nahi karna hai aapko wb use karna hai wb is small letters both are in small letters wb means write in binary rb means read from binary ab means append in binary here the b it is added with these different file modes clear to ab dekho ek command samajh aayi my file open project.dat right my file is a file handle ram mein banta hai ram ke andar file handle ban gaya and this file handle is connected with the project.dat file and this file it is there in the root folder of your python ye apne kaun sa use kiya humne ye relative reference use kiya file ka right it is not the absolute reference it is the relative reference only so here file name and then just see what is the mode wb wb means we are going to write something inside the file in the binary form done now this is the object dictionary one and this object contain three different data element one separated by comma then one two three right now if you supply pickle dot dum dictionary one comma my file my file it is the file handle dictionary one it is your object means when your computer execute the line it will write this dictionary object into the file कौन सी फाइल में प्रोजेक्ट डॉट डी एटी फाइल में नाउ इट्स योर टास्क यू जस्ट ओपन दिस प्रोजेक्ट डॉट डी एटी फाइल इन टू योर नोटपेड प्रोग्राम क्या दिखता है वहां पे कुछ ऐसा डाटा दिखेगा दैट इज नॉट अंडरस्टैंडेबल क्लियर इट इज द बाइनरी डेटा राइट देन आफ्टर दैट एट द लास्ट यू हैव टू क्लोज द फाइल विद दिस कमांड माय फाइल डॉट क्लोज एक चीज और ये जब आप क्लोज कमांड सप्लाई करोगे एट दैट टाइम ओनली द डेटा दैट इज अवेलेबल इन द फाइल हैंडल कंप्यूटर इज गोइंग टू राइट द डेटा इन साइड द फाइल डन नाउ जस्ट सी द प्रोग्राम नंबर टू दिस प्रोग्राम इज रिलेटेड विद विद रीड ऑपरेशन मींस डेटा इज ऑलरेडी देयर इन द फाइल यू वांट टू रीड द डेटा बाय यूजिंग योर पाइथन प्रोग्राम एंड यू आर गोइंग टू शो द फाइल डेटा फ्रॉम योर प्रोग्राम राइट सो हियर प्रोजेक्ट डॉट डी एटी फाइल इज क्रिएटेड अभी बना थी ऊपर वाले प्रोग्राम में राइट तो मैंने क्या यूज किया इम्पोर्ट पिकल द वेरी फर्स्ट कमांड इट इज द कॉमन कमांड फॉर इच एंड एवरी बाइनरी फाइल ऑपरेशन देन द सेकेंड वन एम एफ हियर माई फाइल हैंडल नेम फाइल वेरिएबल नेम इज एम एफ इक्वल टू ओपन प्रोजेक्ट डॉट डी एटी कॉमन आर बी जस्ट सी द मोर आर बी मीन्स रीड फ्रॉम बाइने राइट यहां पर कौन सा लगाया था Right in by name, wb. So here, file is open, and then the data that is there in the project of dat file, the sara data mf file variable will load हो गया. Right, the data is available with this variable, and where is this variable? The variable is situated. It is created inside your computer's memory. Here yeah. now, 
dictionary 2 equal to just see this command this is the data reading command pickle dot load the command is that one to read the data pickle dot load bracket mf mf is the file handle to computer karega kya computer just go inside the file handle and read the data load the data <coughs> from the file handle to your dictionary 2 variable data files are dictionary 2 variable mein aake load hota now the data is available with you with your python program in this variable dictionary 2 variable now the task is very simple you just print the variable by using print command print dictionary 2 and then just close the file right this is the very first video of binary file operation and it is essential to remember these five points are always if you want to create a binary file operation program right thank you very much